In Lesson 5, students are asked to create a parallel circuit. This is a circuit that has more than one path for the electricity. I'm going to move these away and we are going to use one dry cell, two bulbs in bulb holders, and wire. I'm going to use my Fawn stock clips as I have done. Press, hold, press, slide in the wire, release. But this time, instead of just following around, I'm going to have two wires into the single Fawn stock clip. This is how we're going to create two paths. Now the other end is going into the other bulb. And now from the other Fawn stock clip, I'm going to connect back to the first bulb. And finally, I'm going to have a second wire in that same Fawn stock clip. And then connect to my power source, the dry cell. Now, I'm going to move these a little so you can see the paths easier. The power is coming from the dry cell. It is coming to, it could go just through one of the uh, bulbs, but it can also follow through the second bulb. This can be sh demonstrated by loosening one bulb. The other bulb is still lit. That is how I know that I have created these in parallel. When I tighten that one again and I loosen this, this one stays lit. That is showing that the electricity has more than one path, and that is how a parallel circuit is defined.